The loss of Maisha Hutcherson, Maisha Hutcherson, Julie Ruin, and Brooke Brown is going to be uh, really hard on this team. Uh, you know, the senior leadership they provided, the work ethic they had, uh, leadership on and off the court was is going to be really tough to replace. Uh, not only that, you know, Julie was a three-time all-district performer as a setter. Brooke Brown was district MVP last year in all region. And just the experience they had and the hustle, the, the leadership, and just all the intangibles that went into what made them good players is going to be really hard to replace. Uh, the underclassmen are definitely going to have to step up uh, with the loss of Julie, uh, et cetera. Ashney's gonna, Ashney Williams will move in as a junior to be setter. Uh, Vanity Manning, who played well last year on the junior varsity level, will step into Brooke Brown's place, and she's going to have to step up and play well. Uh, as far as the younger girls, uh, Jet Yates, a freshman, and Melissa Moore, who is an eighth grader right now, are playing the role that Maisha had last year. Melissa, as an eighth grader, is playing along the net, and Jet's coming in and playing the back row. Um, and then we we still have some younger girls. Rebecca White was our, our second, you know, uh, our B setter. Uh, Mary Catherine Miller start is playing well. So you know, we're gonna have some younger girls who may have to step in at times this year and, and help carry us, you know, through a season that could be successful. To repeat what we did last year as far as the season that we had and went in the district, we're going to have to execute our fundamentals uh, really well. Uh, we've got the athleticism. We're pretty quick. We can jump. Uh, we move around the floor well. But, you know, even with being good athletes, we have to pass the ball well. We have to serve the ball well. And when we get a chance to attack, we have to finish. So the big key this year is we're going to have to execute the fundamentals, the little things to be successful. And, and most teams that are successful each year, uh, they do those things. They, they do the little things really well, and that's what it's going to take for us.